What is up? I am TJ. This is Uncommon, and so are you. Hey guys, I'm stepping in here on a pre recorded piece for our Christmas break. Now, I hope everybody has taken some time off uh, at least to uh, celebrate Christmas and uh, plug back into some family time. And so uh, we wanted to uh, just hop in here uh, quickly for a, a shortened version of our Uncommon Live. I guess you could say it's Uncommon Somewhat Live. So let's get to it so you can get back to Christmas. Now, if you're new to Uncommon, uh, each week we step in here and on a Thursday about 2 o'clock Eastern Time and do a topic around husbands, dads, and leaders. And so, uh, but this one is around Christmas. And so I wanted to um, challenge us all to get ready for Christmas. Now, it was just 30-ish short days ago that we were all probably learning some very valuable and sometimes intense lessons at that Thanksgiving table. And so some of those may be the following. Prayer. We may want to pray for wisdom for the upcoming Christmas holiday. And this is probably hitting you on Christmas Day, but it may be hitting you before you have any family over. So it may be very timely. The next one is communication. We may want to guard our mouth from poor speech. A lot of communication is happening over the tables around holidays, and it's good to be prepared and prayed up for them. Triggers. We may not want to show up looking to be offended by something. And this was also mentioned for our Thanksgiving preparation. And I can see that in some cases, people may not have been triggered at the event. Some were. Uh, some were after the event. So it's good to uh, not show up with the intention of being offended. Remember, these people are people that you love and have in your life. They're family, they're friends, and so let's approach that accordingly. And the last one is the reason. We should remember the reason of the season is to celebrate in the first place the birth of our Savior and what that means in our lives. And if we are gathering with other people, how we can reflect that. If we get together and we always um, reflect Christ in a bad way, let's pray for uh, some change um, and some uh, preparation and wisdom before we get together again. After all, some of these people may never see Jesus other than your example of him at these events. So let's prepare accordingly. So our uncommon question of the week is, what adjustments can you and I make to glorify God at our next Christmas gathering? Because you could see People leave these gatherings and have opinions and they talk, they, they tell stories and they reminisce or they may pass judgment. Uh, they may uh, tell their side of the story. They may try to paint a picture of what happened. What if we went there and reflected Christ in our thoughts, our speech and our actions? So, um, I encourage you guys to get together with your family and just enjoy each other. Um, and keep in mind that there's a bigger purpose to these gatherings than simply exchanging gifts. So, uh, in the section, the comments, we'll have some supportive pieces as we always do, our devotions, our articles, and maybe even another video. So with that being said, remember, you are uncommon.